What's up guys? In this video tutorial today, we're gonna learn more about what is Tabula, how you can use it, and you know, just understand what the platform does. So guys, before we continue on to this right here, I wanna go ahead and reach out and tell you guys, like, if you guys right now do not have an audience, I recommend you guys going out and figuring out what your audience is. I'm gonna link down a couple of resources down below. And I also created a course that I think will work very well with you guys to be able to see exactly, um, you know, like how to figure out your audience. So something you might wanna check out. We'll talk about that more later in the video. But let's get into it. What is Tabula? I know you're here. Tabula was founded in 2007. Um, right now, it's typically doing about 104 billion um, basic impressions a month, or not impressions, um, actually clicks a month. It's kind of crazy on that part. Their revenue is over about $1 billion, and they have um, roughly over 1,000 advertisers on the platform. I don't really have the publishing stats right now, but there are um, a lot of the big name publishers, such as um, you, have, um, so you have CNN, um, you have um, you know, a lot of different people, like that's a huge amount of platform. So, Tabula. Tabula. Tabula is the world's largest and most advanced discovery platform. And you have other discovery platforms like Outbrain, other things like um, you have um, Gemini from Yahoo. And I have a whole list down below if you want to learn about you know, what's all the options out there. But for Tabula, that's what it is. Similar to a search engine, um, Tabula is, but basically in reverse. Just imagine like instead of going to search engine and typing stuff, it's like the search engine is recommending content based off of what you're already watch, what you're already watching, what you are already, um, what you are already can see, um, and basically what you're already reading, with, based on the content that's there, that's how it recommends the um, everything from the platform point, and basically um, from there, um, basically they have thousands of leading publishers, um, and marketers, and agencies utilizing tabulas right now, um, predictive technology, um, engaging audiences across, and basically um, it helps people distribute their content which is people like me, people like you, people who are selling stuff online or who have an online business or are marketing online um, to engage with audiences across the web. Um, it, it's, so it is supposed to fit in your um, digital marketing as your third marketing channel, if that makes sense. So you're throwing right alongside of like search, social, and now you know with Tabula and all of those guys right now, specifically Tabula kind of pushing the charge, discovery. Um, I've been able to um, easily find that from Discover because we notice like a lot of these platforms nowadays, um, if, when you're ranking a search, you have to go against people who are like me or like Brian Dean or like Neil Patel who are ranking stuff in search and who spend all day and that's what they do and it's comp competitive. But if you do it in the right niche, then you can dominate because there's most times there's no competition in those niches, but it's a whole different thing. But you can use Tabula to help you with those. Um, basically on the Discovery part, Tabula is a platform they have um, publishers. Um, those publishers will come on and, and basically um, publish content, and then they will install a widget on their on their website. Which is not um, it can be this is a piece of coder something that they install into there that will be right underneath the content as a recommended section. And then when someone clicks, that publisher gets money, and you pay the cost. And basically, from an advertiser standpoint, you go on there and then you put on what how much you want to spend, where you want to spend it at, what platforms, all that stuff like right that and like what content you want to push out there and how you want that content to look and where you want it to be or not really where you want it to be but where you don't want it to be from that standpoint. So you do that part and then when the user comes on, user searches on the say CNN and then CNN the user um, searches on there, goes down, reads the article, loves it and sees that your content is recommended, clicks on that, you pay whatever your um, kind of max per cost, max, basically your, um, your cost per click would be, your max per cost per click would be, or somewhere around that, kind of like an average around that, depending on how many other people are advertising, on, trying to advertise over that piece, and you pay that, uh, you pay that to them, Tableau takes a piece, they take a piece, they make money, Tableau makes money, and then you get the actual user to come to your site, and then from there, you can be able to migrate them, lead generation, do different things. Um, Tableau is a company that, um, from there, and like they have pixels and stuff like that, to be able to redo a lot of retargeting, which is, works very well. If you're not doing retargeting, then you need to be on, getting on it really soon. Um, but Tableau kind of puts itself as being able to market to anyone in any of the different um, sales cycles. For me personally, um, I have really seen like, much up most of the, um, the, the opportunities in the campaigns that I've run very successfully have been in the awareness sta um, um, stage and in the lead generation stage. Those have been the most best for me. Haven't really tried many direct sales. The ones I have 
um, were not optimized from my standpoint the best that they possibly could have been. But also too nowadays, um, Tabula has different um, targeting features that allow you to go through and um, actually target based on people's intent, which is crazy right there when you think about that. Right? There's a whole different world right there you can make a lot of money, but I'm gonna do a whole video on going more in depth into that like later on. Um, but that's kind of the basic part. Um, you have advertisers, platform allows advertisers to put native ads. Remember, it's native ads too. So these ads will be very seamless. They won't really look like ads. Um, um, put near target content and then be able to scale and generate awareness, traffic, leads, and sales um, over many topics that you know you want to choose. From the publisher standpoint, if you want to be a publisher, a publisher um, on Tabula can go through and monetize their content, similar to how you do on YouTube. You have a CPM, you have you get certain type of thing based on how good your content is or how well people are where your content and where your users are doing and what data they have on your users. And they have a lot of data, which is really good for us advertisers. Um, to be able to make accurate decisions to sell to more people. Um, and from there too, it helps your website makes more money from the traffic they generate. Um, Tabula is very interesting. So, okay, so you know what Tabula is, and you're probably thinking right now, okay, so now what did I do? I know what Tabula is. Is, is this something I can use? Is this something that's gonna help me benefit? Um, the answer to this question is pretty simple in that part. Um, just like with any marketing media, it just takes time um, to be able to curate your artist. I would say if you are doing something more B2B, um, then you need to watch how you're going to put content out there and use your text as more of a targeting feature than actually um, getting trying to get people click click you want your text to be where it deters clicks as much as possible so you want to get the right clicks so that work out for you on that part if you b2c it is huge honestly if you are not on this you need to be on it it's very cheap and not even too much cheap but it's very affordable I would say um, where you can get stuff like 10 15 6 a click um, really high, tar highly targeted traffic that people actually want to click on view your content. If you do from a content standpoint where you do um, add content then to email and then to sell, tons of opportunity in that part right there. Works amazing on that part. Uh, so, but, so if you're doing that part, but one thing you need to know, if you're on Tabula or any platform that you're on currently right now, if you do not know your target audience, you're gonna have a hard time reaching people and getting sales. Um, so I went through and created a course based off a lot of the um, information and feedback I've been, got, been getting back. Oh, I just stuttered. <laughs> been getting back from everybody um, over like not knowing their audience, not knowing why their marketing is not working because they, they they have not defined exactly who their audience is. Um, I really recommend defining who your audience is at the very very start part before you sell anything, before you create a piece of content. Figure out who you're trying to actually reach and contact and, and re contact with and sell to so you can actually help them more and actually target your information and messages specifically for them, which allow them to actually receive it a lot better. Um, so one thing I would recommend, go and check out the course below. It's really interesting. You'll learn a tremendous amount of information of how to go through and do this right here. And also too, it comes with a free consultation that you can set up with me and I'll help you walk you through how exactly you can use Tabula, any of the other platforms or whatever it is um, and where your audience is online so you can be able to target those people and get those people to buy your purchase your product. But guys, I wanna say thank you so much for watching this right here. If you have any questions, like if you're gonna use Tabula, down in the comment section right now, um, I want you to go ahead and comment yes yes tabula or no tabula or whatever you're going to put right that part or ask me a question and i'll be down there to answer those questions too as well and i'll say guys thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate it and we can do a lot more tabula focus i noticed um through my analytics that a lot more of you guys are actually wanting to um you know go through and learn more about tabula so i'm going to um, make an emphasis to um, put more content that out over um tabula so thank you guys so much make sure you guys like and subscribe hit that notification button so you can get all the videos that's coming up on the channel. And also do check out the new podcast that we're doing for, um, for over entrepreneurs and creators called Up Next Podcast. you learn more about inner workings, about how it takes to make it in these fields, and also learn some of the techniques they use to grow their businesses, their careers, and really um, get them to where they are now. We have three episodes right now. We got a fourth one coming up this week. Um, or not this week. Yeah, we have one coming up every week. So yeah, so it'll be this week. Um, so it'd be very good, interesting information to learn and you can get a lot of that out of this. So make sure you check that out. But don't forget to subscribe. And guys, if you have any questions, comments, or need any help or anything, go ahead and um, leave me a, um, a message below, a comment below, and or message me on my website. Thank you so much. I'll see you guys in the next one.